Welcome, Welcome to, to Mom, mom vs. Chef. The competition where a professional chef and a mom cook head to head, preparing the best dish possible, featuring one secret ingredient. Our first competitor today is mom Greta Hitzman. I've been a mother for 29 years. I ride for the police department. I do mounted patrol and I take care of a ranch and normal mom stuff. I've learned a lot about cooking for kids because they are so picky sometimes. So you learn all kinds of tricks. I am a little nervous going up against a real chef. I don't care what I have to do to it, it's gonna taste good. Just season the holy heck out of whatever that secret ingredient is. Make your palate explode in a good way. If I won this, my oldest daughter who has two children, I have two grandkids, they're so cute. So hopefully she'll learn something from it. And competing against Greta is professional chef Andrew Gruel. My name is Andrew Gruel. I'm chef owner of Slapfish Restaurant Group in Southern California. We have over seven restaurants and I've been cooking for over 20 years. Our restaurant is definitely kid friendly. We're actually trying to get kids to eat more seafood by making the dishes fun and whimsical and you know really playful. I do have a five-year-old and I have a 15-month-old and I love cooking for kids because interestingly their palates are so open. I'll definitely say I'm somewhat apprehensive and nervous about today because she's got three kids. I'm a relatively new father and that works for my kids, but that might not necessarily work for everybody else's kids. For me, it's about validation. I wouldn't mind putting this notch in the belt. Welcome Greta, Chef Andrew. Today you're gonna to be competing to see who can make the tastiest dish possible, featuring one secret ingredient in 30 minutes or less. Please let me introduce our panel of judges. Hi, my name's Anthony, I'm nine years old. My favorite animal is a lion. My name is Boriana, I am 11 years old. My favorite animal is a squirrel. My name is also Andrew, I'm 25 years old, and my favorite animal is the pig. I think it's time to find out what the secret ingredient is. Yeah. Oriana, will you please take the lid off? Mm -hmm. You guys know um, what this is? No. Have you ever had tofu? No. No. This is like a substitute for meat. Instead of pork or shrimp, you could have like little pieces of tofu. Like both? Yeah. You guys wanna, you could pick up one of those. I, don't, I can't explain what it feels like. Do you cook with tofu at home? Not on purpose. When I found out it was tofu, it totally threw me for a loop. I've just never dealt with it before. I don't really have that much experience with tofu. I think I cooked with it in culinary school. Definitely not a tofu expert. Even playing fields. I guess so, I'll be the only tofurkey here. Okay. Chefs, whatever you cook today will have to feature tofu. Chefs, you have 30 minutes to cook. And your time starts now. Hey, watch yourself. You gotta get the good stuff here. Yeah, baby. I need to figure out the template upon which I build something that's fun that I know the kids are gonna like. Beloved tofu. Tofu is very jiggly. I don't care for the texture, that kind of slimy feel. My strategy is gonna be just hide it as much as possible and they won't have to know that it's really healthy. For all those times I made fun of my vegetarian friends, I, I feel know. that this is redemption. So I've got tofu to work with and hamburger, beef. I'll make tacos, kids love tacos. And a little chili powder. Mmm, mmm, tofu, yeah baby. I know that as a kid growing up, I love BLT. Bacon, lettuce, and tomato. Who doesn't love bacon? This could be my secret ingredient right here. So I'm gonna start cutting up my bacon. I'm gonna get that into the pan. I'm gonna slowly render it. Oh, stop with the fancy flip. I gotta show it off a little bit. I That's could try that. Part. I don't think they'd wanna pick it up off the floor. I've got spinach and I've got some lettuce. And the one thing that I know kids love about a salad is croutons. What do I see? Potato chips. Oh my goodness. There we go. How about I triple bread and fry the tofu and I actually actually bread it in the potato chips. Getting into the fried stuff. Low calorie dish over there. I stick the tortillas in the toaster. So while that's heating, I'm gonna dice my onions, my tomatoes, my lettuce, and grate my cheese. I feel like this salad is still gonna be somewhat one dimensional if I don't add another ingredient to it. So I'm running over back to the pantry. I look in the refrigerator and what do I see? Eggs. I can't think of a kid that doesn't like eggs. So I'm gonna fry the eggs in the bacon fat. I think I might actually just end up frying my whole dish. Chefs, you have 15 minutes remaining. Halfway there, chefs. Come on, baby. This is a little side of refried tofu beans. Right now I'm making my version of a ranch dressing. I'm adding a little bit of cream cheese. Never go wrong with cheese. I'm adding some fresh herbs and adding Dijon mustard to cut through some of that richness. And I love bacon. I don't know anyone that doesn't like bacon. You guys wanna go see what he's doing over yeah. there? And I'm gonna check in on Mom Greta. Okay. All right. Hey guys. Looks like you're working pretty hard on your dish. Please tell me you like bacon. We love bacon. All right. What are you making here? Keeping it simple, you know, with a salad. Trying to bring it back to my 11-year-old self. Is yep. that ranch? This is better than ranch. 
It's all homemade right there. Everything's better homemade. Thank you, Chef Andrew. We will be looking forward to trying your dish. Looking forward to serving you. Hey, Greta. Yes, Just sir. checking in on how things are going. So what was your strategy coming in with tofu? Everybody loves a taco, especially kids, right? We incorporate a little tofu in there. Is this something that you've made in the past or? No, 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 not with the tofu. So do you think the tofu is going to complement things? I sure hope so. it up a little bit? <laughs> Let's hope so. All right, we'll let you get to it. Thank you. Wonder if this is all gonna cook in time, I'm not gonna lie. Chefs, you have five minutes remaining. Time's almost up. Yummy, tofu. So now I've got my tofu in the beef, so I'm gonna top them off, and I gotta get my lettuce, because I'm going to garnish and make it look pleasant. Avocado, tomato, and slice my bananas, and I'm gonna surprise them with a banana, honey, peanut butter taco. One minute left. Make your final preparations. I look down on the plate, and I realize that those tots need dressing on them. So I'm rushing through with a spoon to get that last bit of dressing on the tots. Five, Five four, three, three, two, one. one. Oh. 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 Greta, Chef Andrew, welcome back. Got a little tight there. Greta, can you please present your dish? Ooh, looks yummy. yummy. Everybody loves tacos, right? Yes. There's some tofu in there, and if you notice, the one on top has bananas, honey, and peanut butter, and a nice, healthy, toasted tortilla. One, two, three. I like it. You can't taste the tofu, but you can taste the beans, which is really good because the beans are actually amazing. Kind of makes sense amongst the beans. I thought it was going to be like kind of like flavorful, but like yeah. tofu doesn't really like taste like anything to me. Yeah. Thank you, Greta. You're welcome. I think we're going to move on to Chef Andrew's dish. Chef Andrew, can you please describe this dish? I love BLT. It's, it's iconic. I incorporate all these ingredients into the salad, potato chips, crusted around the tofu croutons, my version of a ranch dressing, and fried eggs in the bacon fat. Three, two, one. Actually, I kind of like it, especially with the ranch. Mm -hmm. It makes a lot of sense. I don't really like the yolk, but this one is really good. It feels like a healthy breakfast, like yeah. someone on a diet would eat this. I wouldn't be too sure about that. Thank you, Chef Andrew. Your dishes were both really amazing. We have a lot to discuss. Please give us a moment to decide. Greta's dish actually reminds me of home. We have tacos every once in a while. It was very decorative and had a taco and it had dessert. She kind of took the, the route of hiding the tofu and everything. But we really wanted tofu because that was the secret ingredient. It tasted amazing though. We all found it really tasty. I'm still trying to read the kids' faces. I thought you got really creative with those little tofu balls. Cause I was looking at your dish and I'm thinking to myself, I wanna shove that in my <laughs> mouth. Maybe that's the 11 year old in me. Can you give me details like if you liked it for Andrews? I like the idea of um, the BLT salad cause it gives it a little more flavor. I have never had a coated tofu before. Right. And what was really smart is that he used potato chips. The fried egg did kind of feel like an afterthought. This is a tough decision. Thing is, I think you might have taken it home with the dessert, but I'm feeling pretty confident about my tofu balls. It could go either way. Of course, I hope it's me, but you know, I'll be a gracious loser. <laughs> I think we know who the winner is. Yeah, I think we do. Let's get him back in here. Greta, Chef Andrew, thank you both for coming in today. Cooked some really amazing dishes. Unfortunately, we can only have one winner. Greta, your dessert taco was really good. It was a nice surprise on the plate. Chef Andrew, we thought your salad BLT was a very creative choice. And the winner of Mom vs. Chef is Chef Andrew. Oh, well You're my inspiration. These kids have poker faces better than seasoned professionals. I was really surprised. Ah, I really thought I had a good chance at this, but I was impressed. My hat's off to them. This is the best judging panel right here. I come from a restaurant mentality, so kind of had to flip things upside down on their head a little bit. When I go home tonight, yeah, I might be bragging a little bit in front of the kids. No more saying my food doesn't taste good. Both of your dishes were truly amazing. This has been Mom vs. Chef. What ingredients should we do next time? Taffy. Taffy? A desserty kind, like. Taffy. Oh, yes!